Hi everybody, hope you're all keeping well. Just wanted to give you a bit of an update on where we're at and um, but firstly I might just start why, by uh, thanking our, um, our team that's been implementing our new system. We've just implemented a new computer system and uh, we have a system improvement team that's been working on that and we went live on that yesterday, that was Tuesday and so far so good, fingers crossed um, looks like the new system is working really well and hopefully it makes things a lot easier for our users. Just a bit of an update on COVID. We might all know now that the lockdown or the stay at home order has been extended by another week. Um, that really means that uh, people will have to stay in indoors or stay at home and not travel outside their local government areas. But of course Flagstaff is exempt from that you're able to travel to work we are still open and all of our businesses are operating because we are an essential service so that means that uh, jobs are still here for everybody and we want everybody to come to work um, just to nearly finish off I've got uh, some good news stories um, our good news is that we've just been successful in um, picking up a couple of new customers for our laundry Uniting Care from Nara and Uniting Care from uh, Jeringong and Unandera will become new customers for our laundry. So that is a, a great good news story. So again, Flagstaff servicing our aged care uh, friends and brothers in the community services industry. I'd also like to give you another good news story and that's from our Life Choices team. Our Life Choices team are organising um, COVID shots for a number of our participants who are finding it difficult to get to doctors and to get their COVID shots. So a lot happening at the moment and um, I'm sure there'll be more that we'll talk about next week. So thank you and uh, hooray for now.